Talk London. I'm here today at the Tafida Rakib Foundation Gala Dinner. It's an annual gala dinner here today representing so many young people around the country who need that medical help and intervention. This was formally launched a year ago in 2022 after this poor young lady was taken unwell. They're trying to raise money to set up a rehabilitation centre. So make sure you support this organisation and follow them on their social media and help them to raise the money they need to help these young people to turn their lives around. It's a special charity event. It goes everybody's heart because of Tafida and she went all the way to the Italy for the treatment. I believe that uh, we work with cloud 
also helped the, to bring in the healthcare staffs in the UK. So that's why it goes with our core value as well. So we can work together, we can make a difference, bringing the health professionals, health staffs from overseas and make the healthcare sector more, more vibrant and more special. This charity is so important because out of their own personal anxiety and tragedy, they are finding positive things to move forwards with. Tafida is doing well, despite all of the predictions against all odds. And they are very generously building this foundation so that other children in the future will be able to benefit from the input that's needed and collect the evidence that is needed as to how well these children can do over time. This is a very, very important move. And there will be many families who today have no idea that in the future they are going to need the Foundation's help and support. Thank you. I'm the Vice President of the Tafida Rakib Foundation. I'm a barrister and I'm involved in sort of cases which fortunately coming before the court and have highlighted the really great problems that exist in this country and the lack of the lack of care that's available for children who find themselves in in these difficulties with with serious neurological injuries there simply i realized through my work that there just simply wasn't the adequate medical care available for children in these very serious situations and that therefore there was a great need for an initiative of this sort to ensure that um, that that gap is filled and that children are given a chance to, to recover and to live. My name is Shalina Begum and I'm the founder of Tafida Rakib Foundation. Tafida Rakib is my little daughter who in 2019 sustained a brain injury and we set up this centre so that we can help the entire public in the UK. And how is she doing at the moment? Alhamdulillah, she's doing well, as well she can be. Every day there's improvement. And what do you hope for her to be next? For her, inshallah, for her to return back to the UK. But one important thing is that this foundation is not about her. It is for our children. It is for the future children so that if there is another case like Tafida, we are here to support them. And how did you get your celebrity ambassadors involved? The celebrity ambassadors. So the celebrity ambassadors, um, they came on because the Tafida's awareness has been now, now at this moment, is you know, it's globally. So everyone is aware and people are contacting directly themselves and saying, can we be part of this cause? And how do people get involved in this cause? What do you need as a charity? And so we want the entire community, we want the general public to come forward. We do have a website that they can go in there, log in there and leave the details. We are on all the social media platforms as well. So please come and support us whichever way you can. Leave your message behind and we will contact you. Well, thank you very much and we wish you the very best of luck.